Boostroid is a cloud gaming service that we classify as a pick up and play platform. This means you'll be able to play the games you own on any device through the cloud from third party game distributors like Steam, Epic Games, EA, Rockstar, and more. This is one of the few platforms to offer the GTA series along with the Call of Duty series. It only takes a couple of minutes to get started, so let's boost in and get set up. Boostroid launched their services in 2019 and is now available in North America and Europe. They are planning to expand to the Asia Pacific, African, and South American regions soon. They have support on various devices including PCs, Macs, Chromebooks, and Android devices including mobile and TVs. These TV manufacturers include partnerships with LG, Sharp, Philips, and more. Now the first thing you need to do to get started is to create an account. We have a link to sign up in the description for easy access. Signing up is free and it's the only way to see the complete catalog of games. After signing up for your account, this will be your web dashboard. You are able to play games through the browser here. Now if you're playing on Windows or Mac desktops, I recommend downloading their app and using that instead. You can find that on their website under the Our Apps page. We'll download, install, and run the Windows app for a quick overview. Once you log into the app, it'll run through a quick tutorial. All games are located in the library or in the install section. The install section doesn't mean that you can install the games on your device. It means games will be installed on their servers. My Games is your personal list of games that you have chosen to add from the Boosteroid catalog. Use the plus sign button on the game to add the games you play the most. The icon on the top left of a game represents the third party game launcher that supports the game. Make sure you choose the correct game from the launcher you bought the game from. The icon on the left here is a test connection tool. Run this test and Boosteroid will give you a connection score. The right icon is the link to your account settings. Next, you will need to have a paid subscription to play games on the service. Use this button to get set up for one. Lastly, you'll be able to contact support or access the help files on their website using this link. After the quick app tutorial, hit the subscribe button to set up your subscription. This will forward you to a browser and require you to sign up for a subscription through there. Boostroid currently has two different paid subscriptions, Start and Ultimate. Sorry, no free tier. The Start is a monthly subscription, while the Ultimate is a yearly subscription, respectively. The currency is in euros, but this can be converted into about $10 and change for the Start subscription and about $8 a month for the Ultimate, which equates to a one-time yearly payment of just under $100. Please note that getting the Ultimate option does not mean you'll be upgraded to better gaming servers. Also, if you have a discount coupon, enter it here and apply the discount before the purchase. Once you choose your subscription, you'll enter the payment method screen, accept the terms, and as of now, Boostroid has three methods of payment credit card, Google Pay, and PaySafe card. Choose your payment method, complete your purchase, and then you'll get a payment success message. Feel free to go back to the dashboard and reload the page. You should no longer see the subscribe button on the top. Now you should be able to play any game that you own here on the dashboard. Also, if you have any issues and need to contact support, use the support icon at the bottom right of the dashboard. Support usually responds in just a couple of minutes, so getting help should be a breeze. Now let's get on with playing some games on Boosteroid. Feel free to use the web app, but I'm going to switch back to the Boosteroid desktop app for a more complete experience. I recommend logging back into the app since you subscribed, so the app knows that you have a valid subscription to play. For those wondering what the difference is between games from the library and the install section is, I'll play a game from both. Now if you can't find the game you're looking for from these two sections, you can use the search feature to find the exact game you're looking for from both sections and add it to your My Games list. I'm going to choose a game from the library first. I'm going to add it to my personal list of My Games and then I'm going to hit play. Boosteroid supports mouse and keyboard plus gamepad controllers like an Xbox controller and other Bluetooth devices. As your game is starting up, it'll let you know about how to access the overlay menu to control your streaming session. Hit Control left 2 anytime during your session and bring up the session settings. Here, you can control your input and audio settings along with the option to end your session at the top. Once your game is loaded, Boostroid will show you your connection status. Quick tip, shoot for a download speed above 30 megabits per second and latency under 30 milliseconds. Latency is your distance from the server in milliseconds. Feel free to log into your respective account where you bought the game. In this instance, I own the game on Steam, so I'll enter my credentials here. With the game from the install section, the process is basically the same except for one thing. I'll add Modern Warfare 2 to my games. Once you hit install and play, Boostroid will want you to accept the terms for that respective game, and then we'll run through a quick install of that game on the Boosteroid server. After the installation, you will log into the game normally and play your game.
Once you are finished playing your game, it is very important that you quit your game through the game menu so your third party distributor can save your cloud saves. This can only happen if you quit your game properly. You can always terminate your session at any time by hitting Ctrl F2 on the desktop app or by holding down Escape to release the cursor on the browser. Remember to terminate your session only after you have exited your game properly so cloud saves can sync. Now if you're looking to cancel your subscription, go into the account page. You can check on your specific plan details by clicking on the plan details link. This will give the exact details of your subscription plan which includes how much you will be charged by each billing cycle, your subscription status, and the next and previous billing dates. You have the ability to cancel your subscription on the bottom of this panel. Before canceling, they'll give you a survey. Feel free to go through it or skip the survey and confirm your cancellation. Overall, Boostroid is a solid cloud gaming platform that provides access to some of PC gaming's best games. Join over 3.5 million users play the games you love on almost any device through the cloud. If you're looking to get started, the link is in the description. If you like this getting started overview of Boostroid, give us a like. Also, make sure to join as a member of the channel or join our Patreon, the links below. And above all else, make sure to subscribe to keep it locked right here at the only place we can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle.